Welcome, fellow explorers, to Walled in Days. Today, we're about to embark on an extraordinary journey through the magical city of Istanbul, a vibrant, bustling city that straddles two continents, Europe and Asia. Imagine stepping into a world where history sings in the wind, whispers through centuries-old mosques, basilicas, and markets, and dances in harmony with the pulsating rhythm of the modern city. Over the next five days, we'll unravel the secrets of Istanbul together. So grab your adventure hats, pack your bags, and come along for what promises to be an unforgettable escapade. Greet your day with the rising Turkish sun and step into the culinary heaven of Namli Gurm. An authentic Turkish breakfast awaits, featuring menemen, an egg dish so flavorful it's like a party on your palate. Don't be surprised if it quickly becomes your favorite morning meal. Join me as we stride down the historic lane, leading us to the iconic marvel that is Hagia Sophia. A testament to human ingenuity and the passage of time, this architectural masterpiece has tales whispered within its centuries-old walls. With a history as dynamic as the city it resides in, it has served as a Greek Orthodox cathedral, an Ottoman mosque, and now stands as a captivating museum that draws people from all corners of the world. The Byzantine mosaics adorning the interior speak volumes of its past, their intricate designs capturing scenes from the Christian tradition in a splash of shimmering gold. Alongside them, Islamic elements such as the calligraphic roundels and the beautifully carved mirab narrate the tale of a different era, symbolizing the unity of two distinct cultures under a single dome. The breathtaking union of art and history in Hagia Sophia left me in profound door, and I have no doubt that its majesty will evoke the same sense of wonder in you. Just a stone's throw away, let's meander into the resplendent Sultan Ahmed Mosque, more commonly known as the Blue Mosque. Cloaked in thousands of meticulously arranged blue tiles, the interior of the mosque mirrors the serene, rhythmic undulations of a tranquil ocean. Its oceanic hue is a palette reminiscent of Istanbul's clear blue sky on a perfect summer's day, resonating peace and calm that is as refreshing as the breeze off the Bosphorus. This is no ordinary monument, but an active place of worship, where the sound of the call to prayer echoes five times a day, reverberating through the hallways and inviting believers to pause and reflect. The intricate designs, the domed ceiling reaching out to the heavens, and the six towering minarets piercing the sky, all tell stories of the mosque's grandeur and are testaments to the mighty Ottoman Empire that built it. For those with a rumbling stomach, a visit to Sultan Ahmet Kaftechisi is highly recommended. Renowned for its mouth-watering kofta, this eatery promises a delightful culinary experience. Its signature dish, the kofta, is celebrated for its enticing aroma and divine taste that leaves a lasting impression on the palate. Post-lunch, we venture to the magnificent Top Copy Palace. It's a doorway to the wealth and power of the Ottoman Empire. Be ready to marvel at treasures like the 86 carat spoon maker's diamond and sacred relics such as Prophet Muhammad's cloak and sword. After you visit the top copy palace, take a detour to experience one of Istanbul's famous Turkish baths, also known as a hammam. The Sembalitas Hammam is not far from the palace and offers a unique opportunity to indulge in this traditional form of Turkish relaxation that dates back to the Ottoman era. Cleansing in a Turkish bath is more than just a spa treatment. 
It's a cultural experience that has been a part of Turkish life for hundreds of years. The process involves relaxing in a hot, steamy room, followed by a full body scrub, a foam massage, and a cool down period. After your hammam experience, you'll feel rejuvenated and ready to explore more of Istanbul's wonders. As day turns to night, conclude your day at Hamdi restaurant. Imagine tasting a variety of succulent kebabs as you look out at the mesmerizing Bosphorus. It's a fitting end to an incredible first day and a promise of more adventure in the days to come. Begin your day by savoring a simit from a street-side vendor. This crunchy, sesame seed-coated circle of bread is the Turkish equivalent of a bagel, and it's as tasty as it sounds. The distinct hum of the crowd, punctuated by the lively haggling, signals the entrance into the Grand Bazaar. Known as one of the oldest and most extensively covered markets globally, this is a place where vibrant stores form a labyrinth of cultural delights. Visitors are greeted by a treasure trove of items, ranging from ceramics and intricate lanterns to glittering jewelry and exotic spices. From one sensory experience to another, let's take our taste buds on a journey to the Spice Bazaar. Known as the Egyptian Bazaar, it's a paradise for foodies with stalls piled high with aromatic spices, sweet dried fruits, diverse cheeses, and inviting teas. Let's take a pit stop for lunch at Siyat Serif Burian Kebab Salon. Are you ready to sink your teeth into the most tender, mouth-watering lamb you've ever tasted? Hold on to your hats. We are hopping on a ferry to the Asian side of Istanbul, heading for Kadikoy. You thought the Grand Bazaar was buzzing? Wait till you see the Kadikoy market. The local delicacies are a must try. As the sun sets on your second day, we'll unwind at Sia So Frosty. Imagine the exotic flavors of traditional Anatolian dishes melting in your mouth. It's the perfect tend to a day filled with tantalizing tastes and experiences. Good night, and see you tomorrow for more Turkish delights. Kickstart your day at Van Kovald Evian Trendy Bioglu. Prepare to be pampered with a Van-style breakfast spread featuring an array of cheeses, olives, and jams. Just the fuel we need for the day's adventures. The journey continues with an ascent up the iconic Galata Tower. Constructed by the Genoese in the 14th century, the panoramic vista from the top offers a mesmerizing view of Istanbul sprawling below. The spectacular scenery from this vantage point tends to leave viewers spellbound, showcasing the unique blend of modern and historic architecture that characterizes the city. Let's descend into the heart of Istanbul at Istiklal Street. This vibrant thoroughfare is a bustling hive of activity with shops, cafes, and galleries abounding. And here's a sweet tip. Make a pit stop at one of the street vendors for Don Derma, the famously stretchy Turkish ice cream. Who said you can't have dessert before lunch?
As the morning mellows, we meander our way to Taksim Square. This lively district, a favorite among tourists and locals alike, is teeming with charming restaurants, intriguing shops, and chic hotels. It's the perfect place for some people watching. Lunchtime beckons us to Zubero Kokbasi, a top-notch grill restaurant serving lip-smacking Turkish meat dishes. Their kebabs are hands down, some of the best. Post-lunch, we'll lose ourselves in the wonder of the Pura Museum. This cultural gem hosts an expansive collection of art including one of the most esteemed assortments of Ottoman-era paintings. A feast for the eyes and the soul. As twilight descends, we ascend to Mikla atop the Marmarapura Hotel. Here, we'll indulge in a modern interpretation of Turkish cuisine while drinking in the breathtaking view. As the city lights twinkle below, Let's toast to another unforgettable day in Istanbul. Wake up to a hearty breakfast at Mangari, a hidden gem that offers captivating views of the Bosphorus and the Asian side of Istanbul. Now, that's the way to start your day. Embark on a picturesque Bosphorus cruise, the dance of old and new across the strait, with ornate palaces, charming wooden villas and modern apartments, is an unforgettable sight. And amidst these gems, the Dolma Bas Palace is a sight for the ages. After the cruise, we'll delve deeper into Istanbul's regal past by venturing into the grandeur of the Dolma Bas Palace. This monumental edifice, with its sumptuous architecture and lavish interiors, stands as a proud testament to the royal opulence of bygone eras. It brims with finely crafted furnishings, grand chandeliers, and an array of precious artifacts, each room telling a different tale of luxury and grandeur. Beyond its interiors, the palace also boasts stunning waterfront views, presenting a perfect blend of natural beauty and architectural brilliance. From the lush palace gardens, you can behold the sweeping vista of the Bosphorus, offering a captivating contrast to the regal interiors. From there, we head towards the charming neighborhood of Autokoi. There, nestled by the water, stands the Autokoi Mosque, a striking embodiment of neo baroque style architecture that beautifully complements the Bosphorus. When hunger strikes, the House Café welcomes you with a broad selection of international dishes. Each plate is a gastronomic journey in itself. In the afternoon, discover the sophisticated neighborhood of Bebek. With its lovely seaside promenade, chic cafes, and a stunning view of the Bosphorus, Bebek is a delightful retreat within the city. It's an excellent spot to relax and people watch soaking in the vibes of Istanbul. As the day fades, find yourself at the Banyan restaurant for an exceptional dining experience. Here, you'll enjoy a unique fusion of Asian and Italian cuisines while overlooking the mesmerizing Bosphorus Bridge. As the city lights twinkle on the water, you'll fully appreciate why Istanbul is a city that never ceases to enchant.
kickstart your day at Lane's Menemen, where you can enjoy a hearty Turkish breakfast. If you're adventurous with food, the Menemen here is a must try. This scrambled eggs dish, combined with peppers, tomatoes, and spices, will certainly give your day an energetic start. Then, embark on a scenic ferry ride to Buyukada, the largest of the Prince's Islands. The absence of cars here gives the island a tranquil, old-world charm, offering you a serene escape from bustling city life. Rent a bike or hop onto a horse-drawn carriage to explore this picturesque island. Be sure to visit the Aya Yorji Church and Monastery, perched on the island's highest point. Don't forget to capture the panoramic views, an Instagram-worthy visual treat. When it's time for lunch, delight in the fresh seafood at Milos Restaurant. The taste of fish, fresh from the sea, is an experience not to be missed. Post-lunch, unwind at one of the many serene beaches on the island. Whether you prefer a leisurely swim or simply chilling out with your favorite book, this is a perfect spot to relax and recharge. Upon returning to Istanbul, head over to Karakoy, a vibrant neighborhood known for its artistic vibe and trendy coffee shops, all while retaining its historical allure. Take a stroll down to the Galata Bridge, a perfect spot to click a selfie with the majestic Galata Tower looming in the backdrop. Conclude your unforgettable trip with a farewell dinner at Bork Saba Hattin. Nestled in a traditional Ottoman house, this gem of a place serves the freshest of fish dishes. As you raise a toast to your memorable Istanbul journey, you'll surely be reminiscing about the enchanting experiences this city has offered. Istanbul is a fantastic city to visit at any time of the year due to its rich history and vibrant culture. However, the best times to visit Istanbul for most travelers are during the spring, April to June and fall, September to mid-November. During these periods, the weather is generally pleasant and mild, making it ideal for sightseeing and outdoor activities. The city is also less crowded with tourists than in the peak summer months. Spring is particularly beautiful as you can witness the city bloom with tulips. Istanbul hosts the world's biggest tulip festival each April, which is a sight to behold. Autumn, on the other hand, offers a milder but still warm climate and less crowd making it a good time to explore the city at a more leisurely pace. That being said, if you enjoy winter festivities and don't mind colder weather, December to February can also be an interesting time to visit. Fewer tourists mean you can explore Istanbul's historical and cultural sites without large crowds, and the city is beautifully illuminated for the winter holidays. However, it's always important to check the weather forecast and be aware of any major holidays or events that might affect your travel plans. Also, Istanbul's weather can be unpredictable at times, so pack a variety of clothing to cater to sudden changes. Here are some tips to help enhance the experience of this trip. Travel around Istanbul is made easy with its public transportation. Trams, metro, ferries, and buses are available throughout the city. And don't forget to get an Istanbul cart. It's a refillable smart card for most of the public transport. The local currency in Turkey is the Turkish Lira. While credit cards are widely accepted, some small vendors or shops in the bazaars might prefer cash. And remember, Bargaining in markets is common and part of the shopping experience in Istanbul.
As you visit religious sites like the Blue Mosque, remember to dress modestly. Women are expected to cover their hair, and both men and women should wear clothing that covers their legs and shoulders. Turkish tea and coffee are integral parts of Turkish culture. Accepting a cup is a sign of friendship and hospitality. Turkish coffee is unique with its preparation and serving style. And don't miss out on the opportunity to read your fortune in the coffee grounds. Turkish cuisine is diverse and delicious. From kebabs to mises, from baklava to Turkish delight, make sure to indulge in the local delicacies. Knowing a few Turkish phrases can enhance your experience. Wait. Istanbul is a shopping paradise. From ceramics to rugs, from spices to Turkish delights, there's something for everyone. Remember, it's customary to haggle in the markets, so don't shy away from bargaining. And those are our top tips for a successful trip to Istanbul. Incorporate these into your travel plans to make your visit to this fascinating city even more enriching and enjoyable. Did you know that underneath the bustling city of Istanbul lies a hidden forest of ancient cisterns? These are centuries-old reservoirs built to store and supply water to the city. The largest and most famous among them is the Basilica Cistern, also known as Yerebaten Sarayi, which translates to Sunken Palace. It was constructed in the 6th century during the reign of Byzantine Emperor Justinian I. This incredible structure, capable of holding 80,000 cubic meters of water, is supported by 336 marble columns, each 9 meters high. And there we have it, an unforgettable journey through Istanbul's vibrant blend of cultures. As we close this chapter, we're left with photographs and a deeper understanding of Turkey, a country that's a beautiful tapestry of the East and West. So, as we wrap up this memorable five-day sojourn, I'll leave you with this. When's your next Turkish escapade? Because, as we've discovered, there's always something new awaiting in this fascinating land. Till then, Hoska Kal, stay well and we hope to embark on the next journey with you soon. Thank you for joining us on this journey through Istanbul. If you've enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to World in Days.